But how do I open a stuck ink bottle? I have a large bottle of PR tanzanite that I can't unscrew. I imagine that ink around the rim has, looked, has locked into the threads. How can I get this open without creating a disaster? Um, yeah, so the first thing is to be gentle, okay? Um, Private Reserve especially, they tighten those caps up really tight. They used to, you know, a year, year and a half ago, have a problem with the bottles actually leaking in transit. So they really started to ratchet those things down, and uh, there's definitely a situation where it can, you know, especially with a new one, can be really tough. Uh, however, yeah, if you, it says, you know, you, you told me that, it seems like ink has gotten into the threads. That can really happen with any ink, not just a PR thing, but if you get ink that gets around the threads and it can act, almost act like a glue a little bit, not a glue necessarily in terms of you know being permanent or whatever, but uh, it can definitely, oh, I forgot to flip my little guys. Uh, it can definitely uh, kind of make it tough for you to open that bottle. So be really careful, okay? You can use something like, you know, a sheet of rubber gasket material, a rubber glove, a uh, jar opener, maybe if you have like some kind of kitchen device made for jars. You know, ink bottle caps are a little smaller than most jars, so you may be able to use one of those, maybe not. Um, if you have like a, a set of adjustable pliers or something like that with rubber jaws or some kind of rubber that you can put around there to protect the cap, I've definitely resorted to that sometimes in my own situation. Granted, uh, you know, I was in a, a, you know, state where I didn't really care if I marred the cap or anything like that. So protect it if you want to make sure that it's okay. Um, but uh, one other point about that is to make sure that if you are doing that with something like Private Reserve or Noodlers, they fill those bottles up pretty hard. And so if you have a really tough cap and you all of a sudden, you know, break that thing loose, that you're not tilting it too much one way or the other so that you cause a spill while you're trying to open your bottle. So that's one other point to make. Hopefully that helps you out there, Jay.